guys, IPH for you here, and um, I'm sorry I haven't gotten back to you guys in a while. I've been busy with a lot of things, such as homework and uh, other things uh, for the summer. Um, but today I'm going to do a top uh, 10, uh, just a top uh, tweak slash apps from City again. Um, the first tweak is called Zeppelin, and it basically stores different themes um, and puts them on top in the top left hand corner of your uh, screen as you can see I have the Pac-Man symbol you can change it to Nike, you have the Dark Knight, you have Batman, Apple, Android, Aperture Science, Assassin's Creed and a whole bunch of other things um, I'll just add the Apple logo for right now and as you can, as you can see it says theme stored in library slash Zeppelin so if you have a theme for yourself that you'd like to add you just will be able to go into that and put any theme that you want for example I'll see if I can show this to you now, as quick as I possibly can. Uh, I'll see, probably, I'd see if I can go to iFile. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to actually check to see. Library and Z Zeppelin. I don't know if it's all the way back down here. It's interesting how all this music on here. That makes me think of things that I can do with this. Anyways, I don't actually see Zeppelin anywhere. It said library slash Zeppelin. I'll check. City or something. But yeah, I'll find that out and I'll I'll upload that onto uh I'll upload that to YouTube just so I can show you guys how to do it once I find out how to do it. Okay. The next tweak, if this can open up in time, um, yeah. The next tweak is folder enhancer. And I love this tweak, as you probably saw a little uh uh little uh demo of what I what it did. It basically can change exactly what your folders open up to. For example, if I open up entertainment, you can see it opens up the whole for the whole entire screen, and you can put folders into it and click anywhere else to close out the folders. And this is really it's barely laggy, um, nice frame rate. You can also just uh, zoom out like this, put two fingers on the screen like that, and it'll zoom them out. Uh, and you can also change which way you want to slide it to left to the right, and basically adds more pages. So I'll just show you. You can add two pages for entertainment. And I think that's pretty nice because if you don't want to have, you can put basically all of your apps into one separate folder and other city apps into a separate folder. And it keeps it pretty organized instead of having a whole bunch of buttons on the screen. Okay, so the next tweak, if this loads, is called Arcanoclasm. Um, probably a lot of you guys have heard of this, but it basically changed exactly how the uh, layout of your springboard is, either by 5x5, 6x6, 2x2, 5x2, or 5x5, um, or the normal 4x4. Uh, you can download a whole bunch of other different tweaks and layouts from Cydia. A lot of them are free, and some of them are paid for because of the specialty of them. Um, but as you can see, mine is 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 by 2. Um, and that gives me 10 icons on the screen, which is pretty nice because it, it gives a little, it gives the phone a smaller feel to it. Um, getting back to this. Um, next one is called Password Pilot. Uh, this tweak is basically, it adds, it t if you type in your password here, you can know exactly, um, it already types it in when you go to your app store and you want to download an app. So, I'm not, I don't know if I should show it to you right now, but let me go into it. Open this up, go to App Store, and if you want to download an, an application, you go download to the download application part, and it will automatically have your password encrypted into it. Um, I believe it will already have it encrypted, but I don't want to. I don't want to risk it because I haven't tried it out yet. But I think this is pretty helpful because instead of having to go into the Apple iStore app every single time, you and you need to type in every single time, and it's ready there, and you can just download the app as soon as possible. Okay, the next tweak is called Weather Icon, and Weather Icon basically, um, as you can see, if I turn that on, it can show different 
settings of how uh, turn that on okay so it gives different settings on the weather application As you see down here you can see that it gives you a badge on temperature if you're not looking at it you can see it from a if you're over here you can see over here what the exact temperature is and I think that's pretty nice because instead of having to continually always it's all the time um, open the weather app itself and check the weather it's already there and there are different weather settings if you have to manually open the weather icon app or um, the weather icon app to change the weather settings weather settings so see, see refresh every 15 minutes you can do it manually um, I wish there were lower amounts of time but I'm guessing that um, the only reason why is because um, of battery usage and people don't really want their battery to go fast because of the updating of the weather um, and then the last tweak that I've gotten recently is called barrel I bet a lot of you guys have heard about this but it's basically it changes the way that your um, springboard changes um, pages so for example my springboard you push down and it squeezes the page together turn the page and it looks pretty nice um, a lot of people like the uh, I don't know if this is going to drop my frame rate but a lot of people like the uh, curl and roll away it just curls up your icons into a little a ball shape and makes you turn the page like that and a lot of people like that it looks kind of fancy my, I don't like that one because it makes it laggy on my phone but it's pretty nice Um, they have the world, merry-go-round, and a whole bunch of other things. Uh, I'll just show you the classic one, which is Cube Inside, and it basically gives your your uh, night your phone a nice 3D effect of it in being in a square, which is similar to Android's um, uh, style of turning the page. You can also put it on random so that any other effect that you like would change to anything every single time you turn the page. Um, and that's all for really now. Uh, if you guys have any questions about the apps, um, um, the tweaks that I've shown, I will put them in the description so you guys can see. Um, but if you have any questions, leave them down below. Or you can go on my channel um, and write the questions down as well. Um, thank you for watching. Continue to comment, rate, and subscribe. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. IPH for you, signing out.